Oh, hi there, guys, and welcome back for some more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last part, we made our way up to the Forest Temple. In this part, we're going to be going inside the Forest Temple and finishing up half of it. So long, episode. So here we are with our first intense gameplay. Get out of here, Keys! God damn. Trying to interrupt my monologue? That's not cool. Music in this place is alright. But yes, this is the forest temple, the first temple in the game. And one of my favorite temples, actually. I don't know what it is. I like the feel of the place. But there are lots of spiders here, so we'll have to shoot them in the face with slingshots. Yay. I wonder what's up here. I actually don't remember. I know where to go. Just in case you're wondering, I just don't remember the items. Well, of course, remember the mini boss item. I remember all that, I remember the boss, I remember how to kill him. I is not stupid, bro. But I'm not practicing this game, just in case you're wondering. I will never practice a game ever. Unless it's Skyward Sword. I'm gonna be doing that. But that's because I'm gonna be doing that the week it comes out, so. View ploys? Yes, view ploys! I was considering just doing a walkthrough and not talking, but. Meh. I don't think people will care. I don't know. I might not die. Yay, 10 rupees! Anyways. Let's head back down here. That totally wasn't worth the 10 rupees in case you're wondering. So don't climb up there. If you slide into, or you roll into totem poles, usually good things will happen in this temple, so. Go ahead and do that a lot. I'm gonna tell you. When you see a totem pole in this place, roll into it. And the monkey's already been captured. But we'll free her from this clutches of this evil wooden prison thing? I don't know. Looks pretty flimsy. But whatever. And she can climb pretty fast. But she'll be showing us around this temple, so... Hey, that monkey's... Oh, it's that monkey that stole your lantern. Whatever. I don't feel like reading today. But I will. I have to. Yes, yes, we'll go this way. We'll walk this way, monkey. Never trash the monkey unless it's in Twilight Princess. Yes. Okay! Big Skulltula! Ah. I'm probably gonna... These guys have pretty good defense, so you're gonna have to hit, hit their abdomen most of the time. Although you can't hit them in the front. And then finish them! Finish him. And where's the first wave? Oh, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Or oh, maybe it's not. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, these guys are called bomblings. We will be using them in the future. But if you slice them, they will turn into bombs, then drop them and run like hell. And they'll explode and go ahead and destroy anything in your path. But I'd suggest going down here so we don't have to do this later. Uh, what's down here? Is this a small key? No, it's 20 ruby. Yay, 20 rubies. Alright, and that's all we need down here. I think that's all that's down here overall, so... Never head back up there again. But we'll go ahead and... Look! What are you doing, Link? Oh, crap. Well, then... Huh. I screwed up. Whatever. It's not like we're gonna use those three hearts of... that. But before we go out there, let's pick up... Ooh, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? You got the map! You got the dungeon map! Press 1 to view it! The green arrow... Uh, the green rooms are ones you've been in, black rooms are not. Yellow arrows show where you are, blue arrows are where you entered. My god, I'm not feeling the best for reading today. Oh, that bridge definitely looks safe. Oh, I guess it is. Little giant evil monkey wearing no pants throws a freaking boomerang and slices it in half. Ah, oh, that's classless. That's classless. Put some pants on, you animal. These monkeys are 
going commando, I swear. Oh, what's going on? Has there been a monkey fight? Yeah, it's pretty serious. Oh no, now we can't go any farther. We might as well go back. I don't know what's going on, but it seems like she wants to take you somewhere. So maybe you should just follow her. Yes, that's what we'll do. Of course, that's what we'll do, Midna. Alright. So apparently the monkey wants us to go this way. So we'll listen. Because apparently she knows her way around the forest temple. So. Oh boy, this room. Now go ahead and head over here first. Slice the bombling. Get out the way! And then watch it explode. Because we're about to meet a new character. A reoccurring character. Okay, let's just slice this. Get out of our way. What the hell was that in the pot? The hell? Phew, as at last, gracious, once I got in there, I couldn't squeeze back out. You were a big help. Thanks! I've been looking for something in here, you see. Gracious. You must need something here, too. Shall we try working together for a while, fellow adventurer? You may not think I look like much, but I can be quite helpful. I can even warp you out of here, even if you want to leave. So don't think you me as a burden. Uh, now let's get started. You met Uku! If you call her in a dungeon, she will let you out and allow you to return when you want. But you'll never use her ever, so don't ever even think about it. Just put her in her pocket. Put her in your pocket. And just forget her forever. I've never used her before, but I might show it off just so uh, we can meet her son. But remind me to do that before the last temple. For now, I want to make progression. Is there any other Skaltalas, Wal or Skull Waltalas I can shoot in the face? Apparently not. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to go over there. Sp think we're supposed. Wait, what? What are you doing, Link? Ah, my controls! That's a bad time for them to lock up. If I wave it too much, or if it goes off the screen, it sometimes dies too. Which is unfortunate. What are you so scared of? Okay, there's a skeletal up there. It's a minor skeletal up. Because you can never face it, ever. I've never even killed that guy any other way. Because any way you try, it won't work. Do we have a small key? No, we do not. So we can't go through that way. What you talking about, monkey? Alright, we are not gonna go over there before I spoil anything. But go through this door first, I guess. I don't remember exactly where we're supposed to go in this temple, but I do remember for the most part. So these bridges do play a little bit of a puzzle part throughout a bit of the game. Not much, but through this temple in a little part. The wind blows them and uh, they'll go ahead and spin. But we'll get something, an item that will manipulate them eventually. In the eventually. Eventually. Let's smash more pops. Pops, pops. Oh my god, English. Why are you so hot? English. And we got a small key. It opens a locked door, but only in this area. And we'll be getting plenty of those and hearing that same message about 50 more times. Well, let's roll back over here. Hallelujah. Now we can open that door for you, monkey. I always thought on this monkey, if you look at her, that that little red thing was part of her brains coming out of her head and she had some kind of mental disability. I'm like, what the hell's wrong with this monkey? That's actually a flower, in case you didn't know. So, I'm really stupid. Or morbid or something. I don't even know. But there's a monkey friend! I guess we're gonna have to go rescue her monkey friend. Whoa! That's... That... That didn't look very... Classy. Unavoidable cutscene! You're gonna break that bridge even if you know it's gonna break. Which I do. Conveniently, it breaks when we get to the end, which doesn't really make a lot of logical sense. But it's convenient, so who cares? But anyways, her monkey friend is stuck at the top of this totem pole, and as I said earlier... Whoa, this actually has a roof on it? That's kinda cool. Uh... When you see totem poles, roll into them! And we went way more than this monkey, so that's why we can knock it over. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, you guys aren't tough at all. You guys are like the weakest enemies in the game. Freaking goblins. I thought for a while they were moblins, but they're not moblins. They're just goblins. There are no moblins in this game. Yes, yes, clap it up, monkeys. Let's go back. Hurry your uh, sorry, hairy asses up here. Get your primate ass up on that rope so I can swing back. Thank you. Oh, yes, these monkeys, whenever you see a rope, as long as you have enough of them, they will let you go ahead and jump across. I wonder, is there anything up there? Nope, just random ivy. Whatever. Not that I care. At all. Seriously. But that should be all that we gotta do in this room for a while. So, why don't we head back to where we came through? Shall we? Oh god, I almost missed that. It's not like there's anything dangerous down below and... Okay, you guys better walk this way. Don't be distracted by the freaking Deku Baba. I think it's pathetic. Okay. Open up the door. Continue over here. Jump back. Now that we have two monkeys, we can go any direction we want. Up, down, left, right, up, up, down, down, left, right, B, A, start! Yes, I had to throw in a Contra joke. As soon as I started saying directions, I realized I could make a Contra joke, and that's what I did. So, deal with it. But the monkeys will not come in this room because it's filled with danger. I died on this room before, actually. These are very fierce Deku Babas. I don't know what the hell their real name is, but I swear they're some kind of Deku Baba. They're red, and once you slice their neck off, they do go around for two more hits, so... Unless you have a more powerful sword, winkity wink 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 wink. And these guys are annoying as hell. They suck you down when you jump over them, so you do have a little bit less room for error. But they will eat you and spit you back out. So we can't make some jumps, but if you throw a bomb inside of them, they'll eat it like a dumbass and explode! It's brilliant. And they died of cancer. Yay, cancer! Om nom nom cancer. I swear, I want to pad that, but I can't. Alright, I'm gonna shoot these guys down, because I think we gotta go that way next. I think we do, but for now, I'm gonna blow up this wall. Okay. Yeah, that one's always a close call. Alright, we can either go that way or this way. This way is harder, you gotta roll before you go off the edge or else you're not gonna make that jump because there actually is one of those sucky plants below you. And he does make gravity a little bit stronger. There's something good in this room, I know for a fact. Oh yes, ma Mini, mini boss. Ooh, a small key! Not anymore. So this guy is not very hard. What you gotta do on this guy? Wait for him to try to attack you. And slice his head. I suggest doing a lunge attack, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Because he'll be dead very soon. There we go. He exploded. After that, this guy will open his mouth. And then you gotta play bomb basketball with him. If we can find a bomb. I kinda wanna open these pots. OCD, man. Alright. Kill the bobbling. 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 Man, English is hard today. And then, miss. I got a better shot average here than freaking Shaq. Alright. Let's try Z targeting and throwing it in. Yay! It worked. Explode, you son of a bitch. Explode! Yay, he exploded. And there we have it, the small key. So shiny. Pick it up. And we got another small key, yada yada yada, we're gonna hear that thing a bajillion times. And why don't we free this monkey? He's been put in monkey jail. Because they didn't trust a monkey. And he'll rape you and grind on you when you free him. They'll all do that, so. Deal with it. Anyways, let's get out of here. And yes, all the female monkeys' friends are dudes. I think of one. Maybe one isn't. 
So yes, she's a playgirl. What happened? Oh wait, maybe. Yeah, yeah, no way. I think that makes sense. Oh god, get out of the way. Why do I have a feeling that I can... Yes, I can. Okay. Alright. Strategery. Pick up this bomb and throw it down here. I think. Right? Maybe I'm wrong? Or maybe I'm not. Is there... Yeah, there is. What the hell? Alright, I guess we're gonna try this again. I could've swore there was something down there. I think there's a small key behind this guy, too. There we go! But there's something good. It might be a piece of heart, actually. There's something good. Either that or it's a lot of rupees. It's something worth noting. So, we'll go ahead and blow him up. And then we'll head down here. I said we'll head down here! Jeez. Ooh, three hearts. And if you somehow get stuck in there, there's another bomb link. You got a piece of hearts! Collect three more for another full heart container. I knew there was something good down there. I told you I was right. Alright, so let's... Go ahead and head up here. Now that we've already blown this... Yeah, okay, this is the only other room we can go into. Now that we've blown this up, because we did that earlier, we can go ahead... No, wait, this is where we came from. What was it? Oh, no, 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 we don't want to go through there yet. We want to go through here. My memory remembers. I think my cat's meowing outside. That's not good. Is that monkey sniffing my ass? That's unpleasant. There's another monkey over here. I don't think we can actually get it yet. I could be wrong. Yes, yes, we realize there's a monkey in there. We'll go get... We'll go ahead and get it. These guys are a bit annoying if you are really not careful, but before we do anything, go ahead and roll into that and get yourself a chest. Why did I equip the empty bottle? Take out the slingshot, you fool. Not that we're gonna need any of those, really. And we got a small key. And it opens that over there. So yes, we can free this monkey again. This is where I got stuck my first playthrough. I couldn't figure out where the small key was for that. And you actually do need this monkey to actually get something, so... Oh boy, tile guys. Just go around them. Okay. Now... You're gonna wanna light all of these so we can make a staircase. And then we'll unlight them in the future. Using a new item we'll be getting by the end of this video. This long, long video. Only 17 minutes. And I think we're almost up to the mini boss. So, making decent time. Climb the big stairs. There's Skulltula up here, so we'll go ahead and kill him. Yes, yes, Skulltula, get out of here. Yeah. Okay, you know what? We'll try. We'll wait for him to attack us. There you go! Caught you off guard! Dead! Alright, now let's open this up and free this monkey. Yay, monkey reunion! No, stop grinding! Ew! Ew! Get it off me! Ooh, ten rubies! Ten rubies! Alright, that's all that's in this room, so let's head all the way back. And try not to get thrown off by those throwy guys. These tile guys. Okay. I don't care if I leave the monkeys behind. They'll respawn in the next room anyway, so... Let's head back to the original room. Where we want to be. Go ahead and head down here. Yeah, that thing's still dead. Thank God, I'm like... Oh, if that thing respawned, I'm gonna be pissed. Kinda. Maybe not too pissed, but... Alright. Back through this room. And we should be back in the main room again. And now that we've got ourselves four monkeys, Link can start head bobbing, and my controls can lock up. Wow, weird glitch there. Anyways, let's go ahead and head back over here. And yes, they'll lead us back out to the bridge again, which is where I was going. Well, the broken bridge. But now that we've got four monkeys, maybe we can do something about fixing that bridge. Or getting across, for that matter. So, they're gonna form a monkey bridge! With long cutscenes. So, let's swing across the monkeys. Well, that was just fun and delightful, wasn't it? Alright. Time for the mini boss. Hey, mini boss. 
Uh, I guess you can stock up on hearts, but I'm full. This is an easy mini miniboss anyways, but he does have catch music, so... Wow, late reaction, Link. Ew. So this guy is here with his evil boomerang of death. That's unsanitary. But let's kill this monkey by taking out his evil plant henchman. So what you gotta do is here is hit the totem pole he's on by rolling into it. Like I said, roll into all the totem poles you can. And knock him on his face. <laughs> and he'll get hit in the face with his boomerang, which is actually kinda funny. And then go ahead and slice his butt. That thing is gigantic. Baby got back, man. <laughs> I love that. I can't get enough of it. That's why you put pants on, you fool. Oh god! Oops, I screwed up there. He should be dead soon. As far as I'm concerned. Oh no, he unleashed more of the Deku Babas of death. Oh god! Get over there! Oh, I missed. Alright. I like his theme, and I'll probably put a link to the. Uh, like, a uh, song of it, because I'm kind of talking over it here. And we've sliced his ass so much that he's in so much pain he'll run through a totem pole. I just noticed he has a nice beard. So apparently he was being taken over by a shadow insect. One that just happened not to have a tear of light. And so now he's conscious again. But now that he's dead, why don't we take his loot? A magic boomerang. Which is now gold instead of black. Black and yellow, black and yellow. I am the fairy of winds who resides in this boomerang. You have freed me from evil, and I now have my true power back. Please take it with you. Use it to aid your quest, and may both my power and my beautiful... Hmm. It's a boomerang. If you focus in your boomerang before releasing it, it will unleash the power of wind. Aid you in foreseen ways. So we got the Ranger Boom! You got the Gale Ranger Boom! This mysterious Ranger Boom who houses the Fowry Fairy of Winds and equip it the same way you do everything. And you can lock on to five things at a time with it. I bet even the monkey should be satisfied now. Okay, let's continue homing his place. So now that we've freed their boss from the evil tyrancy. Uh, ty. Tyrant. Tyrancy? Hmm. Is that a word? I wonder. Tyrus? No, I think that actually is a word. Maybe it's stupidy. Tyrancy? Ty <sighs> screw it. I'm not gonna sit here and debacle over myself. D you know what? Screw it. I'm really screwing up the words today. Now that we've freed that monkey from evil, we will continue on in the next part and finish up the temple. See you guys then.